there my dudes, how's it going? Hope you're all doing well today. Welcome back to this playthrough of Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. And we're on a roof. A burning roof. And as you can see we're in exactly the same place that I left off. And we're going to go and deal with this party that's ahead of us. So let's go. Okay, ceramic shard. Alright, do we have anything else? Just burning buildings. Not a lot else, really. Okay, never mind. It's always worth looking around, just in case. Oh, there's a man there. And I can't target him, so he's not a hostile man. That's interesting. Hmm. Okay. Alright, well. We'll leave him for now. It's a big expanse of water, this, isn't it? Oh, I see a person up there. Yep. Right, okay. Collection of little houses. Ah. Silence you. have none of your rabble rousing around here thank you very much like coin purse thank you all right what we got can I get sky oh maybe yes come on over here Come on. Come on. Come and join the fun. <laughs> Silly man. You shouldn't have come to join the fun. Look what happened. Right, can we get... I bet we can't get that one, though. No. Hmm. There's a lot more dudes than I thought there were. Alright. Okay, so... Mm. Ah. Right, run, run, run! I can hear people chasing me. Okay, that was kind of scary. I could hear the thump, 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 thump. Clearly the big guy. He was aggroed, but now he's... Okay, he's... Re 
he's gone. Oh, he's not gone back to the steps, though. Okay. Oh, no! Go back to where you came from, big fella. Nothing to see here. Yeah, it's alright, he's going back. Phew! Could have all gone a bit horribly wrong, that. Right, can I get into the building this way? I can. Right, let's see if we can take out some more before we're seen. Right, same again. Run away. And hopefully nobody will get us. Come on, you can come over here. That's fine. Ha 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 I love the way he's like blah blah It's like who do you think you are Dracula? Right We're clearing them out This is a good way of dealing with it I didn't want to have to take on him and all the ads at the same time so Using Sneaky tactics to our advantage is a good way of doing it, I think. Alright, so now we've got shield guy. No one else on the right side. We've just got... Just the one guy over there, I think, left. Huh. Interesting. I wonder if I can get this little guy. Oh, how am I going to get the little guy without dealing with the big guy? Just going to run away again and hopefully he'll reset. Is he reset? Is he going? Yeah, he's going back. Alright, where are you? Ah, there he is. Okay. Let's do this thing then, shall we? Let's just top up my health.
We'll get a sneak attack to give us the advantage because we'll get one death blow off him. And then we'll see what else happens. Wish me luck, guys. Oh, Juzu the Drunkard. Hey, friend, do you want to help? Wow, I had to skip that. Sorry, guys. I hope you were able to read it. Together, we've got him. Oh, my God. He's like Honda from Street Fighter. And he shoots poison. Oh my god. Alright, well my friend died, so... It's just you and me now, big fella. Ah! I should have jumped, that was silly. Oh no, I'm stuck, I'm stuck! Oh... Man, this guy! He's quite susceptible to shuriken, which is pretty cool, but I'm nearly out. Oh my god! How did I not get hit then? Whoa. Oh my god! I thought I wasn't going to get the death blow. Wow, I'm so sorry, friend. That poor old man came to our aid and didn't last. But he gave us a bit of an edge and helped, so thank you. Your sacrifice was not in vain. Whoa, what a fight. Look at that. So I have no... Oh, I got my spirit emblems back, didn't I? But I had none left at the time, and I used all my gourds. I did have two pellets still, which was good. Right, and I skipped that quickly because I wanted to make that loud music stop. But we got another prayer bead, so that's awesome. And we also got some unrefined sake. Which is where... Ah, oh, there. A bottle of cloudy, unrefined sake. Sake is a drink meant for sharing. This cloudy sake is one of Ishin Ashina's favourites. It has a rich, full-bodied flavour. On the other hand, it has a reputation for getting one too drunk too quickly. Oh dear. With hilarious results. <laughs> Closest thing I can do to kneeling and bowing. Ooh, wow, that was a fight. I'm glad I did it the way I did it, though. 
Well, another beginning of an episode, guys. Another boss fight and another victory. Now we have... Ooh. Dead people. Ah, I knew that there had to be enemies. Oh, ah, what happened there? Why did I, like, pause? I don't know why I just kind of stood there for a minute. I don't know if I got caught or I was out of breath or what. Oh. Yes, sorry, but we have to wreck everything. It is the natural order of things. Dowsing powder. Okay. Destroy all their lovely screens. I'm sorry. Lots of dead people. Okay, so some can't be destroyed. Wow. Such a massacre, wasn't it? I mean, they said, like, obviously that they were bandits and stuff. But, I mean, this is just really, really awful. I mean, this was an assault. More than just being bandits. Ah, there's a person. Item. Mibu balloon, balloon of Soul. A Mibu Balloon filled with fountainhead water imbued with a blessing of departed souls. If one pops this Sakura Pink Balloon and prays, those its water splashes upon will acquire more resurrective power for a time. The oldest of the Mibu Balloons, Mibu Priests are known to pop them as an offering of peace of the departed. Did we have any of them previously? The ones of soul. No. First one. So we've got wealth, possession, and soul. Hmm. Interesting. Wonder if we will ever meet anybody who is a Mibu priest. Mibu. here. Oh, interesting. Oh, what's that? Oil. Why is that different to everything else? Something about that that's not... And there looks like there's some... Look, there's like light. Right, it's not going to let... I've got to look all the way round in a circle now in order to do it. Oh, I can't really see. It's like light coming in from up there. Hmm. Oh, sneaky, sneaky. Hidden, like, device, secret wall. Very nice. Oh, chest. Cool. No baddies, then. Some more divine confetti. So we've got quite a few of them now. That was two we just picked up. So we have five altogether. Hmm. Oh, 
Okay, that's cool. Destroy everything! Two things in here. Mibu Balloon of Wealth. And a light coin purse. Cool. And the chest. What's in the chest? What's in the box, man? Oh, there we go. Oh! I have four now! That's my happy dance. Best thing I can do because there are no gestures or anything that I can do some kind of joy thing. Oh, that's so cool. I have four. Now I can get another um, upgrade. Okay. That's awesome. Right. Um, I think we checked every room, didn't we? Walls. We don't need walls. Okay, so I've just wrecked the whole place. And now I'm going to talk to this old lady. <laughs> she cower. Yeah, she's cowering. Yes, me. わしは恐ろしきものを見た。脇出てくるのじゃ。次から次へと止めどの、止めどの。え、若様。若様がお屋敷の奥に。わしのせがれが伊之助が向かったゆえ、無事と思うが。はぐれ忍びよ。念のため
Run and... No. Suppress presence. Can't get these yet, though, unfortunately. Chasing slice. Oh, I want to be able to do that. Descending carp and ascending carp. Oh yes, I forgot to show you that. I did that before um, before the last video, actually, because I had enough, so I just did it. I, I learned it. <laughs> I haven't done anything with it, though. Acquires the combat art Ichimonji. Ichimonji delivers a heavy one-hit overhead sword strike, deals high posture damage, and also recovers one's own posture with a strong forward step. Single-minded mastery of this technique is the heart of the Ashina style strength. Once mastered, it can likely be improved. So descending carp, what is this? A latent skill that for a few seconds after deflection increases damage to enemy posture from all sources. The Ashina style is deeply rooted in the flow of the fountain headwaters. They believe the act of successfully deflecting a blade is akin to a carp descending a waterfall. Oh, interesting. So after deflecting, you can then do more damage. Hmm. And that one, Ascending Carp. Latent skill increases the damage inflicted to posture upon performing a successful deflection. The Ashina style is deeply rooted in the flow of the fountain headwaters. They believe the act of successfully deflecting a blade is akin to a carp ascending a waterfall. Hmm. So... If you deflect, it increases your damage to the enemy. And then if you deflect on that one, it increases the damage inflicted to posture. Which is good because the posture bar is the thing that you want to grind down as quickly as possible. I think that one... Flowing water. And breath of n nature light. Okay, well, we can't get those yet anyway. Hmm, okay. So that'll be interesting then. So if we deflect... And then attack, the damage... The posture damage will be higher. Cool. Wow, I've got a lot of money. What can I spend that on? Hmm. Do I have... I've got two of them. I wonder if it's worth going to see the guy in the pot to see... Oh, but no, wait, it's only treasure carp scales. I can't buy stuff off him normally. And I don't think I've come across anybody else that sells anything that would... We could spend that much money on. Hmm. It's just, it's quite a bit of money, isn't it? And if you lose that... Alright, look, I'm going to cut it here for a second. I'm going to go off and visit some of the merchants. And if nothing else, I'll just buy a bunch of money bags. Because at least we know that they stay in your inventory. So that I won't lose all this money. Because I've got 12 light coin purses. But the thing is, you know what it's like. The money goes when you die. So, yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm not sure which one to go to first. No, not the temple. Where was there a shopkeeper apart from... Oh, the, our little man. The guy that we've met here that was the, um, the thief. The bandit. Hmm. Uh, I can't remember if we've been back and spoken to him since... Oh, I think we did speak to him after we got the flame barrel before we took on the ogre. I was going to say if there was any new dialogue or anything. So that's there, isn't it? Okay, I'll go and see him. 
And then, depending on how things go there, I will then go... Who else have we got? Oh, we've got two um, crow merchants. Not crow merchants. What are they called? Memorial mobs as well. Yeah, I'll just go and see all three of the merchants we've unlocked so far. And see if there's anything decent to buy. Otherwise, I'll just buy coin purses. And then I'll come back here. So I shall see you guys in a moment. Okay, so I did what I said. I travelled around a bit. All I really bought was coin purses. And I also bought another antidote powder. And something else. What was the other thing I bought? Well, I think that might have been it. Yeah. Antidote powder and coin purses. So I have 17 now. Um... Yeah, there wasn't anything else that I could buy. Um, I did go and see the carp pot noble guy as well, and I only had two. The next thing is either five or seven, I think. So I decided, rather than heading back to where we were, I would come back to somewhere we'd previously been, and we'll try and finish up the loose end that we left here, which was dealing with that ninja guy. Now, I may end up regretting this. <laughs> or I may not. Right, okay. So, I've got to think about... The best way to deal with this guy. So... Maybe... I wonder if he'll be like the Shinobi Hunter if I'll have to use the Makiri Counter. Not sure what else, really. Better make sure I've got... Yeah, I've got them on, so... I'm sure I'm going to need them. Oh my god! No chance! Oh, damn it. Why did I, like, flip away like that instead of attacking him? Ow. Oh my god, that move! <laughs> All 
Alright guys, I think that we're gonna leave that guy alone. I think I'm gonna end it here. And maybe we'll go and try and face him again on the next one. Or I will go back to where we were and we'll progress down that path. And we can always come back to him at a later stage. Because he's kind of annoying. And very fast. And yeah, I, I won't... I, it won't be something that I give up on entirely, but I may break away and do some other bits instead first. We shall see. I don't know. I'll decide. See how I'm feeling on the next one. But hopefully you enjoyed this episode overall. It wasn't all doom and gloom. We did do pretty well. Um, beat another boss, as well as dealing with all of his buddies. We found somebody that we know. Got some new stuff. We upgraded been a few bits and pieces we've been here there and everywhere so it hasn't been a, a complete failure but yeah so that will do us so please hit that thumbs up button and leave me a like if you enjoyed this and leave me your comments down below too i'd love to hear from you and see what you think and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already that would be fantastic if you can drop me a sub if you're new here or if you're a viewer that hasn't committed yet then please do so that would be amazing and also check out my description box for the link to my Twitter so you can follow me on there. And also my donation medium. Should you feel generous enough to want to help support the Geekdom and the continued growth of this channel, then there are two methods in which you could do so. Have a look, see which one takes your fancy more. But, you know, you're not under any obligation at the same time. I'd just be very grateful if you did. There's also the link to my merch shop, so if you want to rock your allegiance and show that you are a member of the Geekdom, have a look and see if there's anything there that you'd like for yourself or to buy for somebody else. And there's also a link to Green Man Gaming. So if you're in the market to buy any digital games, then click on my link. I'll get something from the proceeds of whatever you buy, so the company will pay me. It won't cost you anything extra. And yeah, you'll get yourself some good deals and some good bargains with Green Man Gaming. And that'll do us, guys. So I will catch you on the next one. So you take care now. Bye-bye!